Um, my name is Professor Ming Lim. I'm the Professor of Supply Chain and Logistics Operations and Head of Centre for uh, Supply Chain Improvement. As a centre of excellence, we focus on research and applications in the field of supply chain management and logistics. We conduct research uh, that is interesting and innovative and try to solve uh, business challenges. With the knowledge that we develop through research, we enable companies to achieve uh, business excellence. So our approach uh, is through three focuses, uh, technology innovations, system improvement and process re-engineering. Let's take technology innovations for example. We have extensive expertise in radio frequency identification or so-called RFID technology because of its uh, track and trace capability. Um, in, especially in the logistics and supply chain management. Um, we have a few companies, for example, um, car manufacturers and containers, uh, designer companies, to apply this RFID technology on their products. And um, looked at you know, how to use this technology to enhance its visibility in the supply chain and logistics operations. And furthermore, one key aspect of the system is that it will help to uh, improve their maintenance services on those containers, for example, as well as to uh, prevent, for example, wrong shipments, breakdowns and loss. So one key focus uh, on our logistics uh, research, in particularly RFID uh, technology, is that we focus on the intelligent use of this real-time RFID collected data. Why is it so important? Because this will help us to actually look at how we can focus on the business values, the business benefits that beyond what the current market uh, could prove. So this is the key to our research and I think this is the key uh, for a company to justify a business case for implementations. Our second approach engaging with the business is uh, through system improvement, for example, in the supply chain systems. There's one company called Logistex that we are currently uh, working with, is to use methodology, uh, innovative technology, trying to automate uh, the processes in developing supply chain solutions. So I'm Martin Elliott. Uh, I represent a company called Logistex, which are into uh, providing solutions in warehouse environments, warehousing and distribution environments for customers uh, that are moving goods from A to B in simple terms, yes, and, uh, and the challenges that, that that has by different companies, especially nowadays with the e-commerce and omni-channel becoming the, the key, key element. I suppose one of the things that we do slightly different to, uh, to some companies is that we don't manufacture uh, anything in one sense physically what we, we manufacture is IT we manufacture control systems with warehouse management systems supply chain systems uh, and therefore we're trying to find the right solution for our customer in terms of the kit that goes inside to give them the flexibility of resource as well as the flexibility of the systems with it because we're looking at the process yeah, and the process being uh, the uh, the IT side of things, the equipment and the people that are within it. So it's trying to get that balance between those three elements. Hi, I'm, uh, I'm Simon Hobbs. I'm the, I work for a company called Steve Logistics. Uh, I'm the vice president of their supply chain development team. The reason I'm here is uh, our head office is actually about 10 miles away in Nashville, Lazouche. So uh, as a large third party logistics company, I think it's really good that we can work very closely with, with sort of uh, the academic side of things. So very keen to support the University of Derby and Ming in this sort of logistics centre here. So um, I've been coming here now for the last three years probably. And it's, it's fantastic to see that every year it's just getting bigger and bigger and stronger and stronger. So uh, I've just come out of a sort of panel discussion now. There must have been 15 of us in there from the industry talking about a particular issue. And, and that's, that's, that's just fantastic because normally we're all so busy looking at our own little businesses and our own issues that we don't sort of deal with these on a sort of collective wider basis. So it's, it's a great opportunity to meet sort of colleagues, yeah, competitors in the environment and have very frank and open discussions. So um, it's, it's a great initiative. I'm, I'm glad it's getting better. It's, it's a great thing Ming's done here. I think it's the fourth one Derby's done now. So we've been involved for three years. And I'm hearing next year there could be a yeah, sort of logistics course here as well which again is, is, is awesome, so we're very keen to support that. So we can link the, the practicalities of, a, of a, um, an operations, be it warehousing, trucks, planes, ships, etc., 
to put in the, the reality side of it alongside the academic side of it to support Ming with that. So we've got a, uh, a centre of religious excellence down in Ashby and Ming and his team have been there already and it just, it just walks people through a supply chain, you know, all the components of it and of course what we do as an organisation. So I think Ming's quite keen to bring the students down in year two or whatever and show them this, this is what I've been teaching you. So it's great and very keen to support and hopefully back again next year. Mm -hmm.